Do you get starstruck when you meet I people? I do sometimes. I do sometimes. I remember when I was young I, and I met Laurence Olivier. Wow. That was... Uh, I, I used to collect autographs at the stage door, you know, and uh, mm -hmm. he came out. And I remember so distinctly that I started to cream in my knickers. I could, <laughs> I could feel it. I could actually... I don't think I've ever been more uncomfortable in my life. <laughs> I think that's the worst moment of my life. Yeah, well, I've heard you talking about there's mysterious hair loss for women. You mean the balding pudenda? That's what I mean. Yes. What? The balding pudenda. Pudenda? Yes. Pudenda. Yeah, got you. What is that? Well... In one's youth. Oh, wait, do I want to know what this is? I don't know. I don't know if you do, but I will just put it Let's this it. way. <laughs> there was once a time where... <laughs> I don't even know if I should tell her. I'm really tell her. Tell her. I can't believe you don't know <laughs> what a yeah. tender is. Uh, can you say pubic hair? I can say pubic hair. Pubic hair? Yeah, oh yes! <laughs> You're not a doctor, but we'll still let you. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Once where there was an afro... <laughs> right. ..that I could put beads on and braid. <laughs> wow. Yeah. There is now Paul Schaefer's head. <laughs> Paul Sch okay. okay. Okay, empty bald. There we go. <laughs> but there's more to it, but you have to come. You have to... <laughs> <laughs> Cameron has also been in the papers recently, uh, very, feeling very strongly that all women should maintain some pubic hair. <laughs> Cameron feels... Cameron feels very strongly about this. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's not exactly that. I don't say care, maintain. like... maintain. No, 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 we'll maintain. Is in a jar, or...? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. That would Somebody be retain. Um, to the okay. allotment. If, I... if you had an aspect of husbandry about it, right. Richard, you it mean would be to maintain. Take it out every now and then, comb it. Yeah. <laughs> Close it back in. In terms of my comfort zone, I'm far away from it. <laughs> <laughs> I've left the zone of safety. <laughs> I'm in the wilderness. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> See the forest through the trees. Is that is an inappropriate metaphor given. <laughs> Talking about. Uh, really? Okay, can I just clear something up really yes, quick? Yes, please do. If you would. Okay. Yeah. Did you ever ask your a question like, why are you there? Why are you there? Why <laughs> are you there? <laughs> it's there is a purpose. <laughs> <for it. laughs> I want to have a direct communication. Why are you there? <laughs> why are you there? <laughs> Sorry, I just thought a slightly louder voice might get enough. <laughs> does, does yours talk? <laughs> the washing, you were very hungover. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Go on, tell Tony Foster that story. <laughs> <laughs> All their stories are really cool, though, Graham. When I was teaching, <laughs> which is what this show is based on, I... I went home one weekend, and I was in my 30s. I was probably 33 years of age. I went home to see my uh, mother, and then I went back. And while I was at home, my mother did my washing for me, because I was only 33. <laughs> and then I went back. And on the, on the Sunday night, I got really drunk, uh, and then I, I went for a curry. And then the next day, I went into school. I'm going to. I went into school, and it was a school in Slough, and it was a, quite a rough school, but they had a really brilliant hearing-impaired department, so there were he hearing-impaired kids who, uh, you know, struggled. Mm. They, were, they were really looked after in the school. Anyway, I was really hungover. I went there, and about break time, I felt really uncomfortable. I thought, something's not right, you know? <laughs> so I went to the toilet, and I pulled my trousers down, and uh, uh, some of my mother's knickers had got... <laughs> I got mixed up in the wash she'd done, <laughs> and I was wearing my mother's underwear. <laughs> and 
I went, oh, God, oh, no. Oh, I remember going, oh, you loser, this is <laughs> such a low point, you fucking loser. <laughs> and then... <laughs> and then... The curry and the booze... <laughs> the curry and the booze kicked in from the night before. <laughs> so I... I, ha I did, like, a faecal Jackson Pollock. <laughs> <laughs> and I started, I started going, oh, God, not this, not this as well. Oh, Jesus. So I cleaned myself up and I pulled my mother's pants back up. <laughs> and I went back into the um, classroom and I saw one of the hearing impaired kids just looking at me like this. <laughs> and that's when I remembered that my, I had a microphone directly. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Weird. And don't answer this question if you don't want to, Patrick. Okay. But I have... I don't know why you brought this up, but I did hear you discuss that you had an extraordinary disagreement uh, with your wife about yourself. Do you know what I'm talking about? By myself, you mean... Yes. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> uh, <coughs> listen, yes. listen, do you know um, this story? I do not know listen this Listen with story. interest. Uh, well... well, 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 well one night, as you do, we were talking about stuff. <laughs> and uh, and uh, I just had no interest in it. And of course, being circumcised, I said. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they were chatting. They're married. They're married. They're allowed. <laughs> and she said, She said, You're not circumcised. I said, What do you mean? You've only known me a few. I, I, all my life. I remember my mother telling me why, because it was fashionable at the time. She said, you're not circumcised. I said, that's ridiculous. I should know if I'm circumcised. <laughs> of course I am. End of conversation. But the next day, I happened to be seeing my doctor. For... Are you OK? <laughs> I, I, I was seeing my doctor for my annual physical. Of course. So, uh, while he was down there, <laughs> I said, um, Excuse me, oh, oh, by the way, uh, Irv, um, <laughs> my wife and I had a little disagreement. Um, <clears throat> I, I am circumcised, <laughs> aren't I? Because she says I'm not. And he goes, <laughs> Not. <laughs> I said, no, 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 it's not possible. So he looked down again and he said, hey, I'm Jewish. I know the difference. <laughs> <laughs> that, is, uh, that is a bizarre story. Too much <laughs> 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 Oh, God. I have grandchildren. <laughs> 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 <laughs>